you went through a divorce, very big hardship. Sometimes for no reason a man will come, he met a girl in the nightclub and he comes home and he says, I divorce you because you know what, I met Susan. Well, to hell with him and his Susie. <laughs> Allah saved you from something bigger. Pick yourself up, stop pitying yourself and stop wanting to harm him, it's over. Allah will deal with him. For as long as you want to pay back and revenge and retaliate, you're harming yourself, you're not going to survive that hardship. It's going to affect you. So to survive that type of a hardship, get on with life, get up and move, forget about that. That was a dirty episode, a bad episode, subhanallah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us, guide us. So you need to get up and move on. And guess what? Perhaps Abdullahi will marry you. MashaAllah. And what happened? After that, you think to yourself, Oh Allah, I thank you that I went through this divorce. Because had I not gone through the divorce, I wouldn't have married such an honorable man. Flawless. Flawless meaning in the eyes of human beings sometimes. I know of many cases. Today, I spoke to someone. Today. And this person was telling me, Wallahi, before my first marriage, I used to make dua. Oh Allah, give me a husband like this, like this, like this, like this, like this. And so many things, I had a list. And I got married, and I had the worst condition. And I tried and tried my best, but it ended in divorce. And after divorce, I went through hardship because there is stigma of the family and stigma of the others. And the people, because you have a child, they are pulling tug of war and so on. And it is very difficult, so hard. And I kept on making dua to Allah. Oh Allah, I know you have a plan for me. I know there is something. And I kept on trying. Now some people, they go through one divorce and that's it. You know what? I'm not going to get married again because men are bad or women are bad. No way. I mean, you're trying to tell me I'm bad. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us. They are beautiful people, lovely souls. There are so many. And then she told me today, she says, Wallahi, I want you to know that I married again. And it was a miracle of Allah. Every dua I made was answered. Amazing. And you know what I said? Allah wanted you to appreciate the man he had always chosen for you by making you go through someone who was not a good person for you to know what good and bad is all about. You don't know heat. You don't know what hot is, right? Until you know what is cold, subhanallah. And you don't know cold and cool until you know what is hot, subhanallah. No, sorry, I'm talking of heat. I'm not talking of hot as in hot, you know. So the hardships, the difficulties you are going to go through, Allah makes you go through difficulties so you can recognize ease. And this is why, wallahi, powerful means of survival of hardship is when the hadith of the Prophet ﷺ says, no matter what you are going through or you have, unzuru ila man huwa dunakum. Look at those who are worse than you. 